Hey guys, what's up? Just a really quick video here. I want to show you um, how to speed up. If you installed Pinball FX from Steam um, and you did it correctly from the Nailbuster website. Hold on, I'm sorry, I had you guys sideways here. It's kind of difficult. Um, all right, you go to the two files that you put in your, your pinup system launch folder. All right, there were two files. So once that's in there, you go to pinup system, launch, and and it's it's gonna be these two files here that you put in there. Popper launch pinball fx.ahk and .exe. What you wanna do, click on the AHK one, left click with the mouse, now right click with the mouse, and then edit with notepad, okay? This will open up. And that hurt. Oh, I just hit my bare foot. <laughs> okay. Um, now see right here, the second line, it says, after game, um, I'm sorry, after finding window and waiting to see, press any key to continue, wait, before game load, all right? That is set at, I believe, 12,000 uh, when I first got it. And my screen would come, come up where it said waiting to continue. I'm sorry, press a key to continue it, for like, like 10 seconds maybe. It was waiting instead of just hitting it. So I changed only that number, okay? from whatever it was, 12,000 to 6,000, okay? Then you, when you change that number, you hit file and save, okay? But you're not done. Once you save that file, you're gonna come over back to your, uh, your pinup system launch folder where you have that AHK file, AHK file which you now just edited and saved, right? Right click, this, co this menu comes up. Not run script, you wanna click compile script. Okay, right now mine's great because I, I didn't change anything, but you'll be able to click that. You just click compile script, right? And what that does is create a new popper launch pinball fx.exe with your new settings. So like if you did that in an, uh, M, you know, uh, a folder without any other files, if you just want to see how it works, that's what, that's what that does. All right. And I'll show you, let me mute this. I'll show you what that does. So now when I go to, uh, pinball FX, all right. Okay. Man, I wish you, you guys, you smart guys out there, please, can you get Doff Flinks working with uh, with this? Please, I beg you. Like, I'm a light whore, as you can see, and I'm proud to admit that. <laughs> All right, but anyway, so here's Pinball FX, okay? And we have, let's see, we have, let's go to recently played Wild World. I say Wild Wild West, it's Wild West. West Rampage. Now let me launch it. And let's see how quicker, how much quicker it goes. Couple seconds. One, two, three. You can see I got everything. Everything up there is loaded. I even put a little back last thing. That's gonna go away. All right, take a look. Look how quick it went. You. It was about one. It only flashed once. Press any key to continue, and it. And the script kicked in and, you know, and started it. Instead of waiting, because some when you're staying, uh, it's not just me, but say you like, it's doing all, this is all on its own. Boom, it's launching it and right in. And now you're in there, ready to play the game. And, it, and you're good to go. So, uh, yeah, so that's it. That just had to speed up loading into uh, Pinball FX, the new Pinball FX Steam version, cabinet mode, um, that one little section, all right?
obviously everyone's computer is different um that's my baby down there which is rid ridiculous yes i like the bragging that's rtx 3090 in there and under this little thing this is my new build this is a pci generation 5 uh motherboard ddr uh five six thousand megahertz memory and a ryzen 9 7950x 3d processor that boosts to 5.7 gigahertz it's insane for gaming uh too insane for pinball but that's how you do it guys all right peace